let's talk equipment now. Sure. How do we how do we set up the webinar? What equipment do we use? How do we go live? Sure. So when you're why don't I just show you? All right. Let's do that. I'll take let's a little take trip. Take a walk. Yeah, let's do that. So we're gonna we're gonna take a little trip and walk this way. Um, hi everyone. So usually in the opening of the show and the closing of the show, you'll see the in-house and behind the scenes. So we're gonna take you kind of back here. These are our people watching. Hey everyone. Hey, cool. Um, so hey. <laughs> so now we're walking back here to our video village. And as you can see, um, we have a few people working back here. This is Thomas McCall. He's our senior producer on staff here. So Thomas. Tell us what you're working on. Tell us what you're cutting. Describe some of the positions of people back here and what everyone's doing. Sure. So we have Mike over here. He basically is in charge of everything related to audio, and he's mixing the show for us. I'm acting as the director and technical director for this show. You can see that I'm cutting this on a live stream HD 550, which allows me to basically, I can show you here, it lets me do all of my graphic overlays. Um, and cut between cameras and actually encode directly from this device. Um, and as Joe mentioned, it's important to always have backup. So as you can see, I have a backup encoder right here. And then we also have a cellular modem right there in case our office internet goes down. And it's all about just having a plan in place when something goes wrong. Excellent. Thank you, Thomas. So now let's walk over here and uh, we're going to talk with another Livestream staffer. This is Dave Tyson. He's one of our producers here at Livestream. So Dave, why don't you tell us about the cameras and talk to us a little bit about how you guys decided where you're going to place these and why you're using these cameras. Sure. So uh, we're shooting on three Sony PMW300s. They're really nice prosumer level cameras. Uh, if we're shooting in a studio, they give us a really nice broadcast quality, but they're also rugged and portable should we want to take them out in the field or go handheld like our cameraman right now is doing. Um, I'm operating the wide shot, as you saw in the beginning of the show, because it's a really nice establishing shot of the Brooklyn studio, lets the audience know where they are, um, and then we also have two main cameras over there for you guys. So when we want to do tight shots onto you, we can get that nice tight framing, really get that emotional connection with you guys. Excellent. Yeah. Great. Thank you very much. No problem. Now get back to work. All right.